did a video recently on this one. This is the Ponsiris trifoliate. This is the flying dragon variety. This is uh, also known as like hardy orange or bitter orange. I believe it's from Asia and this is a kind of a wild type, old type of citrus. Primitive, I guess you could say. They use this as rootstock because it's so hardy for a lot of other uh, citrus varieties like lemons and limes. And it has just uh, come into blossom. I noticed the blossoms opening up a little bit before the leaves. Here is the new growth that's forming. This is deciduous. This is a real easy one to grow. It grows all the way down to zone five. So most people will be able to grow this. Uh, I think there is, you know, like a non kind of squiggly form, just kind of like a standard form that grows more straight. But this one is uh, interesting, architecturally interesting. See all the kind of crazy growth habit, lots of big thorns on it, but it's a nice plant. And uh, I'm thinking with the amount of blossoms, it's never had this many blossoms before. I think there's probably 30 or 40 that I have a good chance to actually get some fruit. I've had uh, I've had it to start to develop fruit, but usually they drop off uh, with the amount of blossoms it has and the warm weather we've been having. I think that these will get pollinated quite well by the pollinators. A lot of times this uh, time of year is kind of rainy, so and can be cooler so the bees and things like that may not be out but we've been having really good weather so i think uh this is the year to get some fruit you can make kind of like a marmalade out of it or you can use it uh, in cooking as a seasoning or you don't want to eat it fresh uh, you can use it in drinks so plus the oranges they are orange uh, small but it's very ornamental usually they're on you'll see them in the fall and stuff so see how it goes this should get uh, at least six feet tall and around it might even get bigger uh, I moved this around a couple times so it took a while to get going but it's been in this spot for over a year now so I expect this year it's gonna put on some good size I've actually yet to see a big one I know they're around uh, this is not a not a difficult plant to find but I think it'll look pretty nice anyway thanks for watching